hi everybody uh, today i'm going to show you about point lights so if you go to the website dot uh, unreal engine dot com 5 us point lights in unreal engine you will find a page like this and here they told about point light in detail so here you can see a point light worth much like the real world bulb uh, actually it's so worth like the real world bulb and it have the performance its own uh, it uh, give light in all direction so point light uh, have the mobility setting static uh, stationary and mobile so here you can see static which means it cannot be changed in game it is a fast method method for uh, rendering and allow for bath light uh, basically it uh, doesn't change in gameplay now stationary it uh, only have its shadow and bounce light from static geometry based by light mass all other light lighting will be dynamic and movable is uh, all dynamic it's all dynamic lighting so here you can see the light uh, uh, radius and here you don't see the radius Uh, point light have uh, different space uh, you have uh, reflection uh, space color setting highlight and etc now point light have uh, various uh, properties like intensity light color attenuation radius source radius source length afflicted world clash shadow indirect light intensity and many more other option you can modify it and um, make a uh, prefer lighting for your scene so there is a light function uh, light mess etc so go to our project we have selected directional light uh, we have soft angle make it zero so where is our directional light it's in here so drag it drag it into the in front of the door so you can see if we make it up uh, you can see that uh, in this direction directional light uh, give uh, light we can make rotating and give a beautiful effect so we have intensity of uh, 10 we can give intensity of uh, 0.1 because we are to try uh, point light so we need a black color so build all level and if we build now our light is uh, static the color will be reduced hugely yes that's the black color i wanted so if i search directional light again here is the directional light and if we rotate it uh, you can see there is a uh, less color so uh, there is a three way to inside your point light into the scene if you go here lights and point lights and you can choose other light also if you press right button and place actor uh, there will be all light also and from windows uh, place actor and there is the light here is the light and this is the light we can use in our scene now i will add a point light right button place actor point light this is our point light uh, make it upper so there is a three mode movable uh, static stationary static mesh have uh, nothing will change in the, during the gameplay but you can change in movable so this is the function there is a source radius if we make it higher you can see the reflection the point dot is uh, uh, becoming very big uh, that's uh, this uh, function do we can make it big or small mm, 
there is a soft radius we can increase and you can see it met the softness so we can use combine and use both of it uh, source radius and soft uh, source radius there is a source length and if you increase it it will look like this the light will reflect like this so you can rotate and it look like a wall light which you which we use in our home make it upper and it also give light like this so decrease make a zero of all function now we can use the temperature Uh, temperature if we make it higher it will be high and if we make it lower it will be low it will be red and if higher it will be uh, greenish so it depend on you if you want to use it uh, people use it for architecture visualization if we deselect the effort uh, to world it will uh, no color and if we enable class shadow there will be no shadow so let me demonstrate you so add a box solution bots not collision and there is the shadow you can watch and if we select the light and deselect the crash shadow there will be no shadow so you can use this part function there is a, a indirect light intensity you can see the side is now glowing otherwise it will be a little darker on the side there is uh, intensity if we make it uh, if you increase the value the light will be more bright you can change the light color you can give any color you want and the scene uh, light will be changed You can increase the radius attenuation radius uh, you can see in here we are outside of the so that's the attenuation radius do there is other advanced settings there is a visible you can uh, make it invisible so bring back my old light and if we off the visible there will be visi there will be no light so if we uh, play press uh, play it as a actor hidden in game and if we go see uh, simulation mode there will be no uh, light and if we unselect it you can we can see the light so you can use this function in your blueprint basically sometimes you need to use it so actually we use the light on the wall on the side of wall a little bit upper so i am show showing it here so make it two basically in studio we use light like this we can copy it by pressing alter and mouse left button and drag so uh, there there is light like that also if we delete it there you can add the light on the middle and you can increase the value and make the whole room very bright so this is for today's tutorial i hope to see you in next tutorial bye bye everybody